Fried Tipo.
Don't get killed. Cut fire! Uh, 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 dragon shot! Not yet! Now! Focus! Not bad. Whoa, we snap here! Finish them all! Demon fist! One! Got it! Demonic chaos! Who's next? Nice job, Alvin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep the guard down. Yeah, yeah, Sorry about that. Just keeps getting better. That's Canbalar's castle. Jude! You're okay! 
Mila, I missed you! Am I glad to see you? I'm so glad you're all safe. It's good to see you again. I wholeheartedly agree. Mila? Oh, do I know you? I've never seen you before. Huh? Why, I am your elder sister. Sister? I don't have a sister. What's going on, Muse? This may be our first time speaking true. Yet we are both spirits born into this world at nearly the same time. Well, you definitely are a spirit. That much I can believe. <laughs> no need to be so suspicious. What could a spirit gain from impersonating your sister? You are Maxwell, after all. That's true, it wouldn't gain her anything. Why did you appear before Jew? <laughs> because you summoned me before him. Or rather, your powerful feelings for him summoned me. Really? Could that even be possible? I don't know. I'll admit I've been hearing a voice in my dreams. Wingo? Hold that thought. So the information was correct. I despise that man, Gilland. He promotes peace, even as he uses Spyrex to hurt humans and spirit kind alike. We may have no choice but to eliminate him and his group. I agree. How will we do that? Those people have armored soldiers and flying ships and big cannons and... 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 Alvin, it's time you came clean. You should tell us everything you know. Alvin! I assume Gaius won't stand for this. He is inviting us in. Frankly, I'm surprised he even revealed himself to us. Maybe they're testing us? It's not a trap, is it? What are we waiting for? Let's go. What happened? I'm on the straight and narrow now. I promise. And why would we believe you this time? I have a score to settle with Gillen. Let me be the one to finish him off. If I betray you again, you have my permission to run me through with that sword of yours. So let me come with you. And if I refuse? Then I'll kill him on my own. Very well. Thanks. I appreciate it. We have to find out what Gaius is planning. Yeah. Thank you. 
As I always say, it's the gear that makes the man. Well, after one scarf, of course. That's your priority? Are you really Mila's sister? I am. Although it differs from the way you humans conceive of sisterhood. In what way? I couldn't say. I know little about the human version of the concept. But you brought it up! So, elementally, what kind of spirit are you? Oh my, what temerity to ask such a personal question. Wait, what? Alvin, you're committing sexual harassment! Wait, hold on, I didn't mean anything. Oh, okay then. Sheesh, every bit the painter's sister is, but in a completely different way. Everyone sure has gotten stronger. 
especially you. You've really improved. I appreciate the increased strength, but I worry I'm bulking up too much. Never took you for one to care. Of course. The Lord of Spirits needs a suitable vessel. Better to be toned than to be out of shape. Totally. Strength is beauty. I think it's a good look. Buff Mila is the best Mila. <laughs> well, if everyone thinks so, maybe I will try to tone up a bit more. Do it, Mila! Yoked out bazongas! Okay, yoked out bazongas! I'm not sure you'd want that. I have you to thank for saving Jude. Not at all. Jude was quite a help to me. Thanks to his direct tethering with me, I was able to recharge much of my lost mana. Jude, you direct tethered with her? Uh, yeah. Muse asked me to. Was that bad? <laughs> bad? It's, uh... Direct tethering is something a spirit and a human do when, uh... It... Since we were together constantly, he was able to fill me with loads of mana. I... I had no idea you were that kind of man. Mila, wait! Why is she so angry? My... I can't believe you'd ask me to explain that to you. Do you just want to hear me say it? Is that what you're into? Someone tell me what is going on with these spirits. Hey, Alvin, why is Tipo always talking about bazongas? What does that even mean? Oh, he finally asks. It seems you're ready to take the first steps towards becoming a man. Why do you have to make everything so weird? Forget I even asked. Bazongas are the burning fire at the heart of manhood. <sighs> Rowan? Jude, there are times to play it cool, but a man who fears his own passions is no man at all. Yes, exactly what I was trying to say. I'm not even sure I know what we're talking about. Then you will never know Bazongas. You have to want it, Jude. You have to need it. Then teach me about Bazongas. I can barely hear you. You have to mean it. <gasps> teach me about Bazongas! Whoa! Don't go shouting things like that! Don't scold him, Leia. I read about this in a book. It's called Puberty. We're supposed to be understanding and supportive. Mm -hmm. Don't hate us. There's no shame in being burned by the fire of manhood. Does anyone else think that Alvin's acting kinda weird? Alvin's always weird! <laughs>